Also, welcome back, guys. My name is Amlan, and in today's Make Launch Free campaign, we go about trying to solve a peculiar issue wherein, like, despite putting in your WhatsApp number, you don't get the verification code by SMS. In fact, you are presented with a message that is something like this. Now, go ahead and take a screenshot so that you have a screenshot of this particular issue with you right now, and then tap on Learn More. So, once you tap on Learn More, what happens is you get to see a video which helps you know how you can verify your phone number, but that's provided you get a verification code. So that doesn't really help. So I go back, tap on the three little vertical dots, tap on help, and then it says that the problem has been detected. Now, once that's been done, what you can do next is tap on this doesn't answer my question. Now you took a screenshot, but somehow the screenshots don't get added here. Now I've copied a certain text. I am putting in that text here. So I will put this like in the description in case you want. So like I'm saying that despite trying many times, I'm not getting the verification code for my WhatsApp account. Then from here, tap on next. It will now take me to a screen wherein you will see that there are quite few many help articles, but you are not getting your verification code and that doesn't seem to come here. So just tap on this doesn't answer my question and it takes you to your mail client. So everything is already written here. Simply go ahead and attach like that screenshot which you had taken. So once you have attached the screenshot, so like the screenshot is also now built in. So you can now simply send this to WhatsApp and that should be it. Now, as soon as you send the message, what you will see is like, if you head towards your mail client, you will already get a message from WhatsApp, which says that the registration has been reset and we simply need to restart our device. Now, before we restart our device, what I will also suggest doing is head towards your settings and head towards your applications. And here, head towards like the dual messenger app or maybe the WhatsApp application. So I will actually go ahead to the application and then search for WhatsApp. So this is the present WhatsApp for me. And here I will ensure that the permissions for SMS has been given. Because if you don't allow permission for SMS, then things won't work, right? Also phone calls because you can do verification over phone give access to everything so this may take a few moments so why we do this is basically the whatsapp will now be able to use the phone native feature of sms phone and other things you would be getting the verification by sms so it's important that you give this now simply go ahead and full stop this and then like simply restart the phone and like once you restart the phone and the phone is rebooted then basically you simply need to power on whatsapp so here my phone is rebooting so it's rebooted. I will simply go ahead and put in my screen pattern for unlocking the phone. Check that you are getting proper signals because obviously you will be getting an SMS or a call from WhatsApp for verification of account. Now simply go ahead and power up or boot up the WhatsApp thing. So once you go ahead and boot up WhatsApp and now when you try and do the process, you will see that you will get a six digit code. You don't get the message. So everything is working. So I've already got the six digit code right now, but I'm not showing this because I really don't want to access my account, but hopefully doing this, you will also be able to fix your trying too many times to fix the verification code thing. If it's not working, then try deleting cache and just reinstalling the app and surely you will be able to use the verification code that's come to your mobile. If all this is helpful, kindly consider subscribing to the channel. Please share this with your friends because this can be an issue many users are facing. Until next time, it's me, Amlan, signing off.